Alright, so if you want to create multiple Gmail accounts, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to do that. So you don't have to worry about phone verification because with this method, you can also create bulk Gmail account without using any phone number for verification. Alright guys, so for this method, we are going to be making use of a VPN to create our bulk Gmail account. Now, I know many of you have actually come across some videos on YouTube teaching you how to create multiple Gmail accounts with use of a VPN and trust me, it doesn't just work. So, I'm going to make sure that I use my settings for you. So, what I'm going to do right now is to share my own VPN settings with you. So I'm going to be leaving the link down below for easy access. You download the VPN and automatically I'm going to be giving you the login details. So you can also use the same VPN that I use. So right here you can see on my screen, I'm going to connect my VPN so that I can start creating bulk Gmail account and you're going to see how everything works no issues no stress so for this particular vpn i've got quite an amount of countries that i can connect from and that is why i want to share with you so use the link below to download the vpn into your computer and also you're going to be finding the user details on my screen so that's going to be displayed on the screen soon so I'm going to come here and I'm going to use Canada for instance and mind you guys you can use any of those countries because I have been able to update the settings and you can work with any country of your choice so let me work with Canada all right and now it says waiting for a usable network so let's wait for it to load up and once this loads up we're going to get connected to Canada so from there we can proceed with creating bug gmail account with no phone verification all right guys so you can see that we are connected already to Canada all right just to make sure that this is actually Canada I'm going to come over to my browser and um, I'm basically on the site that can detect um what's your IP where you're basically browsing from and if I reload this basically let me reload this okay um very quick all right guys and you can see this that we are already um based in canada all right so this vpn works so now that we're able to set up our vpn now we can proceed with creating our gmail account all right so i'm going to be using my microsoft edge for the purpose of this video and i also recommend you use microsoft edge so right here you can see we are microsoft edge so i'm going to be working with um you know a private window all right that would actually add much more security settings to my network so i'm going to search for gmail.com uh, okay all right so i'm going to wait for it to load up very quick all right now i'm going to click on this one that basically says um create an account because we want to create an account all right so i'm going to we have many options here guys we have for work for child for personal use so let me quickly go with for my personal use and right here is where i want to impute my name so um just to play around let me add in christian here okay and uh, right here, I'm just going to add in Charles, all right? That, that's a very good name to use. So just fit in the details and I'm going to click on next, all right? To show you guys that this method works, the VPN works and everything works perfectly fine. And now uh, for my basic information, I'm going to work with month. I'm going to work with March. That would be a good fit for me. And for the day, I'm going to select 20. And for the year, let me just go with 2002. That's not a bad year to use. And um, the gender, basically, all right, it's going to be a male because I'm a guy, actually. Then I'm going to click on um, next because everything looks good from here. Okay. All right. So my, uh, my settings, my user settings is going to be all my gmail address is just going to be christian charles at gmail.com so let's see what's actually available i'm going to click on next okay all right now then i have to input my password guys so quickly let me input my password all right
okay all right so i'm going to um add some extra keywords to my password to make it much more stronger all right well good so i'm going to click on next okay now guys so you can see that instead of it asking me for a phone number is asking me for a recovery email now the thing about google is that i really don't understand why google would actually request phone number from some certain persons and request recovery email for some certain persons but for me lately using my vpn i've been able to use um you know without phone verification so now they're asking me to set up my own home address i'm just going to um skip this because i don't think i want to add this right here on this um gmail account so i'm going to click on skip okay and now you can see it says that you're signed in already add the profile picture or sign up to get useful update or tips i'm also going to um select not now because i don't want to do that right now so you can see i've been brought over to the privacy and times page so right from here i just want to make sure i read through all of these things i'm going to click on uh, more options okay go down all right go down a little bit all right because there's something i want to show you guys go down a little bit i'm going to come down right here all right send me occasional reminders about the settings then i'm going to click on agree because every time you create a new account you want to make sure that you are telling google that you review your man and not a bot very very important okay and here we go guys you can see we have our gmail account already created for us now this is how i was able to create a brand new gmail account with a vpn and like i said i'm going to leave the link to download the vpn down below and also you can find the user details displayed on the screen right now so here you go guys you can see we already have a brand new gmail account created for us so please if this actually worked for you let me know in the comment section below and if it doesn't Please let me know. I'll try out other methods to see on how you can start creating book email address. So I'll see you in my next video. Please take care of yourself and bye.